Welcome back guys, finally after a long time, to my new run, and well, let's see how far I actually take it, but this is my idea currently, it has all kinds of lore I'm gonna explain, obviously on lovely difficulty number 2560. Um, basic idea for this character is first of all a royal, you see it right here, and if you look at the traits, royal noble, royal noble, son of noble, uh, basic principle is we have an impulsive and like reckless noble son this is why i also have to straight the trade itself does relatively little i just added it for the law then obviously we're like a noble son due to being a noble son i will also get some bodyguards these are almost crucial or essential to clear the uh, nameless forest i don't know how else you can clear it with like one in each stat and no equipment <laughs> so we get some bodyguards uh, then obviously we are noble we get daily income this is actually a really nice trade it will help me a lot then obviously we have son of noble as well we get 20k coins uh, as a starting bonus more gift effects here again the gift effect is increased just so i don't have to grind gifts for that long uh, then to make it a bit more enjoyable for my side, I also added the Martial Genius trait. It's effectively the effective learner. It should be effective learner trait and another combined. So you get like, uh, where can I show it? The sword, instead of increasing by two, it's increased by four. That's the basic idea. Or well, right now it would be one and it's increased to two. So it's doubled like that. And most importantly, the XP is lowered. It's really annoying to level up those martial arts, especially in the early parts when you can't really do any combats. As such, we're gonna do it like this. And then what else do we have? Yes, uh, I also took 45 achievement points worthy of traits. So that's seal immunity, regenerative body and hardy. I was trying to uh, only take 30 points which is the base amount every player has access to right from the get-go however i quickly realized seal immunity is um essential and i forgot about it so it's like essentially hardy and regenerative body i took and then obviously the traits are at one i am i can already tell you that playing with mods so Leveling up the different stats is going to be a bit easier, but it just saves time. I also have like the gambling mod if you've seen it. And yeah, I think... Right, another important detail is I'm going to do this run without any homestead transfers. So no uh, Xuan Yuan, Fairy Skirt and Imperial Seal on day 4, as, long, uh, as well as all kinds of martial arts but we rather have to progress the story pick up what we can and see where we end up and it's also going to be intriguing i have not done this for a long long while and i actually miss it uh ignore these items this is for the skin changer mod which you can see right here i was trying to pick a like more noble appearance for the main character and like the way you do it you equip it you go in this case next page next page page Zhongzhou area Liu for me and then you can just equip it this is another like more experimental experimental feature but uh, it does not really impact it and well we got some like starting items I obviously tried to not pick any starting manuals like legendary or epic ones as that kind of defeats the point of like the no homestead transfers and yeah the rest i think stays the same an important thing when i'm already here console is opened by control and f11 for anyone wondering and it feels so much nicer with fast speed just help uh recovers HP very important <laughs> very important although I don't know how well I can use it this is gonna be an adventure uh, 
just rest for a bit. And like, I only hope that I am not immediately killed by the snake on the first hit. But that I rather can like tank a hit from the snake, thus my generals get summoned. <laughs> and they can defeat it for me. Yes, I am that guy. Yes, please. I am gonna quick save. I don't know how well this is gonna go. Yes, I could do the fame trick right now. To be honest, I should do the fame trick right now. By the way, also really fun. Zero benevolent starts, so every snake in this lovely, lovely place will aggro you. Let's see how go well it goes. Okay, we have issues. <laughs> we certainly have issues. <laughs> heavily wounded and I think I died, yeah. And this reminded me right now I want to switch to the other font. Pixel. Uh, and I have another like uh, Battle Through the Heavens mod which is purely in Chinese. We're gonna get some like cutscene but we'll ignore that. Now I need to figure out whether it's possible to not die if I don't get crit. Yes. No. <laughs> and I can't even look at the chat log. Huh? Okay. We may need to use some like Janghu knowledge and all to level up. We'll actually continue trying. Like how much do we have? How much does it take? 4k, easy. Okay, I'll one more try and one more attempt. Yeah, nah, if he combos you. I swear this was like a crit and everything. <laughs> okay, let's go on, we'll actually be serious. Um, first of all, I can see it like the BTTH thingy. Uh, just pick this. We'll use the fame trick. I need some Janghu knowledge and it will certainly help. <laughs> the fame is not that important, but rather the, I think, 9000 or so? Or am I messing, uh, switching them up? Uh, Shifa. The reason you go there, obviously, is he has one of the highest fame levels. I think he's like even 10. The other grandmasters are one is eight, the other are two, I think. Yeah, it should be like that. Uh, where can you see his fame? I think gift menu. There they go, fame ten. So I think it was you hit him, hit him, and then mid combat you return to the main menu. You load the quick save, then you level up a bit with Janghu knowledge. Did I remember to equip this manual? Yeah. 3k. Okay, like level 10, come on. Easy every time, right? Please, help me! Help me! Help me! <laughs> yes, easy every time, no sweat ever. Uh, yeah, okay, we got like 9000 Janghu knowledge. It's essential because a level. I didn't even get XP for it. A level up obviously full heals you. And by the way, with this high of speed stat, it's gonna be really annoying to sneak by. Ah, uh, this is the um, BTTH mod thing I told uh, you about. As you can see, it doesn't have any text in the English version, which is a bit of a shame, so I had to play on Chinese. <laughs> it was actually quite amusing as well to play like that. Like, I will try to help out. 
I want to head to the nameless village as soon as humanly possible. Okay. Can someone explain this to me? I don't think I quick saved. I'm that stupid idiot that did not equip. The initial snake did like 120 damage. Yeah, I did not. Uh, initial snake did 120. Why did this one do 200? 200 damage, come on. That's a bit confusing to me. But you can see, like, without bodyguards, this is impossible. My, like, first step when I get to the nameless village is also leveling up my stats. And I even forgot to take, like, the steam buns from the starting menu, so I could have, like, leveled up my constitution a bit. And 10 constitution is gonna go a long, long way, I can tell you. <laughs> so is probably, like, Wall of Steel. Wall of Steel could be very helpful in the early parts with the bodyguards. We love it. I, this, this time I'm gonna make sure to quick save, okay? <laughs> uh, okay, nothing really going on on this card. I forgot to level up. Come on. I am. I am. Mentally a bit behind right now. Okay. Third try is the absolute charm, okay? But like, I was hoping actually that it would not uh, hit for that much. Like the first hit, 83, I could easily tank that. Then the combo was like 50% uh, of the initial damage, but then of course secret. I'd actually have to check how much a crit does, like normally uh, it increases damage by 50%, well at least it should, but I think there's like another modifier for how much they deal on 2560. Okay, third time to travel here and hopefully the last, <laughs> otherwise it's gonna be a bit pathetic. Also, maybe the horse is gonna be how I clear the end game. Would be hilarious as well, but it should be fine. We're gonna do the uh, old man sect questline. Obviously, you need to learn from everyone. It's too insane of a trade. Then, like my ideal build, I already thought about is like a cont tank, constitution tank. We get the nine province manual from old man. Then obviously we have regenerative body somewhere. 165. What is that? Like, that's nothing. Please don't kill me. How, how, how did you get this many actions? Sorry. How did he do this? <laughs> uh, yeah, I actually think about it. It's gonna be. If I take like 9 province manual, wait a second, if I get people's palm, I need to do the ice demon quest. If I do the ice demon quest, I cannot get 13 sutras. Okay, I think we are running without 13 sutras for once. There you go. We're gonna kill ourselves to reflect. I'm gonna do it now like this. Frick it. Should have done it like this from the start. I was not imagining spending like 15 minutes on the intro and trying to get through the initial part of the forest, but here we are. Return to main menu. All because I did not quick save after getting it the first time. And I need to keep like some Jangu knowledge so I can fully heal, because I don't think I took HP recovery items. Like, in fact, all I need to do is spend a turn. Like, those bodyguards appear after the first action. First action is either I get hit by an enemy, 
Why just say I forgot I even have like one point? Constitution, hell yeah. Uh, passives. Absolutely. We're taking this. This is 3% damage reduction. That is insane. Quick save this time. Come on, please. Why does it sometimes get to attack again? <laughs> I am so... How did I do it the other time? If I did not manage it at all, I would have said, okay, maybe this is not possible right now with the current setup. But I, I've got through it once. How did I get through that fight once? Like, he hits me, he combos me. Okay, that's fine. That's normal attack. But then he does another attack? I think those, like, generals should be level 60 or so. How come they don't get an action? Like, come on. Come on, game. Or do I really need to skip the first snake with the fight trick? But even that is not worthwhile. I don't have 10 intelligence, which is a big problem. So I cannot get the XP scroll from that, like, steel, if you know what I mean. Okay. We're gonna level up again. It's just so I get, like, my 20 HP healed I got from the Constitution. There you go. 189. Clearly. Please. Hey, look at this! How? <laughs> How does this happen? The, the generals that are summoned, the guards, they should even get the persuade buff, which is 35 action speed, if I recall correctly. We can look it up right now. Once it loads. Come on, game. Come on. Thank you. Uh, persuasion. 30 action speed. <laughs> we are fighting a level 1 enemy. My god. Okay, I'm actually gonna save this run uh, in front of the Schiffer guy. This is getting obnoxious. DLC 2 busted, yes. Yes, because the DLC 2, in case you did not know, is slightly busted. Just slightly. Can't believe it. 19 minutes. <laughs> 19 minutes. At least I'm having fun. <laughs> That's the most important part right now. Okay. I, I have 400 I actually cannot level up again. Yes! Yes! All I ever wanted <laughs> was to see you smiling. <laughs> Holy! Quick save! Quick save, six I can't believe it. Ignore once more. It's such a shame that you don't have any text. Even if it was like MTL, you could play with it, but like this, it's quite hard. I'm gonna go all the way back here. I don't care, I have a quick save. It always targets me. Are these guards this slow? And why is this one snake so powerful? I'm gonna skip the snake then. But if I skip the snake... 
I need five berries. And there's gonna be the Liu Shuba fight, like the Hunter fight as well. How do you do this? How much do I have? 9k. Nineteen. Nineteen is what I can go for at most. Like Wall of Steel, absolute game changer. But I need uh, five more levels. Twenty-four and I cannot get it. But I, I, I seriously was expecting these generals to be somewhat stronger. They most likely don't even get the 2560 buffs. I bet with you. Freaking bet with you they don't get it. Okay, we're gonna quick save now, just getting an obnoxious. Quick save now, I said. Yo, Dex. Actually, I'm gonna go normal game speed right now. Yes, Viper. Do you perhaps want to move? No, no, I actually prefer 2.5 over like 2. Like not possible that one. Let's see if I can somehow live through this and see the break of dawn. No. Ah, oh, he actually helps you. Okay, we almost have all the berries as well. Sorry, I don't want to offend you, Hunter. This is Sodoran. No, no, no. I am at 1 HP. Okay, at least we know what to do. It does not matter if we lose the Hunter fight. I forgot we had 1 HP. This certainly is like the most challenging run I've did so far. <laughs> I truly was expecting the bodyguards to simply carry us. It does not matter how we stand, the boy is always gonna go. Like this, we are closer to the boar than the hunter is. Come on. Why do you always go for me? Come on! So many people around! But as well as like the preferred setup almost. I hate that it automatically cancels your stealth modes as well. A stealth mode. I need this stupid berry. Do I have enough? I was about to say where where's my uh, second constitution we are heavily wounded okay this is getting a bit scarier here get me out of here get me out of here
refuse, <laughs> absolutely refuse this. Get me out of there. Not ready yet. <laughs> I'm a martial genius, yet did not get any XP so far. Incredible. I'll accept this blaster, sure. This is the stuff. There's nothing for us so far. Cover 5% of lost HP. The advantages, of course, we have like a bit of money. Like he can keep the money to himself, I don't care. I have daily income. Stone Grant a Constitution XP. Perfect. Okay, where can we pray? I think I need incense to pray at the abandoned shrine. Luck at the statue. Dex easy. Strength. Strength is also important. Uh, look at my HP now. Easy. Easy, everything's easy all of a sudden. We just get some strength as well. Medical teaching, sure. Like, this is also nice that I get so much progress simply gifting stuff. I'll help you find that, definitely. We can also give some things to her. And it's actually important I gift uh, some things. I need benevolence. <laughs> I need it so badly. Oh. Uh, what do we want to do? We want to talk with the miner. Definitely. Simple pickaxe. Let's go. Bomb, bomb. I am so rich now. Look at copper, look at iron. Oh, and it even had. How many slots does it even have? Wow. I don't care. That's what happens when you get all kinds of mods. Okay. Okay, heavily wounded. This is max, this is plus two. Int and luck. I don't think we can get any int or luck XP right now. I would love int XP. We'll actually have to consult Willy's guide right now. The one stop compendium. Compendium, sorry. Uh, how to get stronger quickly exactly? I'm a, I don't even know how many hours, 350 hours person. And we'll look at how to get stronger quickly exactly. Peer Blossom, nah. How to increase stats. Intelligence, Confucius sample, yeah you need incense, appraise names items, I don't have names items, yeah okay we can't do anything right now. 
By the way, what we also like. Do you have any gifts for him? Easy. How to abuse games. Like, we look at it, it's like 17 won, uh, 381. So we go and buy all of his meat. We don't buy those manuals. And then we sell the meat. We bought it for 20, we sell it for 35. And suddenly you made a profit. <laughs> It's obviously due to Mercantile and him having like a high relationship with you. That's that way you get stuff cheaper. You can go even cheaper, I think. Somewhere. There you go. Sincere, if you have uh, trustworthiness higher, value of our items increases by 50%. Mm, am I on a time limit? Not really. Let's be honest, just let's rest, then head to the Nameless Forest again and try to level up a bit. <laughs> or at least get some XP. It should be fine now. 500 HP. Uh, let's get rid of. Like we're close up the mountain. I'm so going wall of steel as well. Like I need to do I need to survive. We could also reset for the mountain uh, forest pass, but uh journal. Explore nameless remove. We could also try the parry. Uh per exactly the parry, the spa. Parry. What the fuck? I'm parrying my life. Look at this daily income. Need to say instance. Okay, not happening. Look at... Yeah. They don't even move. The old man can't even come out. I need to actually take a look at these stupid... Gods, it can't be that they are this weak. What do I even have them for then? They, they, they deal no damage. And I can't get any XP. Okay, auto save. No. <gasps> Wait a second. I got 4 XP. We won the battle. 4 XP. And that's why we're martial genius, so I can actually level up my stuff. <laughs> On the wind bomb technique, yes. We just need to endanger every human being in this vicinity. Yes, that's good. Evasion, evasion, and like they can tank, but they, they, they don't deal damage. Okay, good. I got some snake skin. I am making big fucking money. I, I can't even get an act. <laughs> yep, I've been practicing this day and night. Look at it, 6 and 10. Whew. Insane. Now you see like 12 XP. <laughs> you see why the straight is necessary. <laughs> uh, how healthy am I? The joke is even the revitalization technique. Like it heals you after each action. I am not getting an action. Like, clearly only one should focus on me, right? 15 damage only, like that, that is sustainable.
I wish I could actually inspect their characters to see what kind of stats they have, but I am simply not getting an action. A sword or rainbow sword. I'll take it. Level 10, everything. Kill or subdue that. Yeah, happening. For sure. And maybe if I. Okay. Now I could inspect them, right? Once I get my action. If I ever get that. They all get silver tongue uh, the buff. So why are they this. Why are they this slow? Holy god, I'm getting a seizure with this. 57! 60! Also, I actually thought guest characters get the 2560 bonuses. Like, look at the old man when you summon him with uh, your trade, he gets the bonus. If you have the early access, uh, what is he, what's he called, Ban Ping Shen, something like that, metal, and you summon him, he gets the bonuses. These also have like a blue HP bar, as such they are guest characters. So why do they not get the bonuses? Like this is pathetic to be honest. I actually thought they would do something. Instead of just like wasting turns. Kill or subdue the boar, forget it. They are just stealing XP, let's be honest. Like, look at the old man! He's popping off immediately! He's going in, immediately taking action, immediately dealing heavy damage. And then you have these stupid guards. Plus one bleeding. Plus two bleeding. I don't know. Also, I just had like a thought. It's going to be really hard to get the plus one intelligence from enlightenment. Unless I actively do not increase my intelligence. So it's like the question, do we want to be a bit weaker early game? And thus have like slightly stronger stats late game? Or do we immediately increase like in... Chingong, yeah, okay, that's a bit annoying. Two days, two days, god damn. I think we're just going to be chilling a bit in the Nameless Village. Benevolence 100 is so important to me. Did I interact with this guy yet? I don't think I did. Sure, just give me that stuff. Wine, I don't have wine. Oh, 
Alright, Silvana, I mean, just take it. Take it or leave it. Okay, we want, don't want that stuff. And he can leave again. Uh, do I need to pay for a room again? No. But she's gonna kick me out if I sleep for four hours. I don't even get like full stamina recovery, but that's fine. I'm learning, it's fine to learn any technique right now. Probably can level them up like this as well, right? Hopefully? No? Right, I wanna tame this guy as well. Let's go! <laughs> I just wish it was faster. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh no! Okay, that, that is just horrendous. I did. I destroyed. I, I don't care about the map. It's time to do some actual stuff. We need to increase our power a little bit. And get some more monies. Important to postpone this challenge as well. Pets are not allowed. Oh, it's me. Yes. Postpone. Now we can show off our like favorite gambling mod. In case you have not seen the uh, video demonstration I did fit. Oh, triple three! That that is really triple three again. Holy my like it's through the roof. And now comes like the boring part of buying some gifts and all. I need to increase the stuff a bit. I need to somehow get stronger so I can like first of all do the old man quest to get even stronger with that. Then I need to do the uh, sidey poison testing to get a lot stronger like that.
Come on, three yes. Let's play another round. 28k, thank you for that. I'll gladly take that. Celestial Lady. Only reason I'm learning is it's better than a blue martial art. Like 100 defense, 100 uh, HP, 300, 300. Insane, insane. Is this is like not okay. Never mind. Uh, how important is trustworthiness? Law. It was benevolence, wisdom, and righteousness. If I recall correctly, benevolence, wisdom, righteousness exactly in an order. So, what is impacted by trustworthiness? It should only be the disciples of Confucius trade. And that's not that important. Yes, skip. Now we'll just go to the market. And I don't think I can even unlock the homestead right now with my setup to farm some materials. Let's just go to the next city right now. Then to Dalyang and then Dalyang farm some money. Okay, here we're gonna get our luck up first. And once we're a bit stronger, we can deal with that red ball. Some no idea. This is already good enough. <laughs> I still am heavily wounded. Okay, we got that stuff. How good is the sword? I can't even equip it most likely. Oh, pretty. Action speed decreases. Uh, I forgot to buy the map. Huh? Do I need it? Whatever, let's just buy it. Can I? Okay, I cannot buy anything from him right now. That's a bit annoying. Thinking, thinking. Anything else to do right now? How do I become stronger quickly when you're so weak? Great question, great question. Now whatever, I'll eat in a moment some lunch. And we'll think about it then. I don't want to meddle in that. I am dying if I meddle in that. We need the night auction, that's the important stuff.
can you yes, the spawn with her uh, will be cancelled? Can't do that. <laughs> it's a bit of a shame. I can't even defeat the first Vagabond. Oh, maybe we should try it. So we can try to unlock the homestead. At least have a uh, like slight hope. And obviously we need to go out of gambling trade. Very important. Please skip. Also, why do they become friendly when you steal like all the money? Look at this, I won and then relations increased. I get it, she's like impressed that we are such a good gambler. Like, move, bitch, move. But come on, sometimes it's weird. Okay, now we'll buy some gift items for all the people. And we'll ignore Sakura. Decisively ignore her. We're perfectly here for that auction. Do I need. Uh, I have money. Let's be honest. I probably should give them some stuff first if I can. Okay, I'll keep my one fruit. Everyone wants wine, and I don't have wine. Damn, he's more expensive than the nameless uh, butcher. Nothing, whatever, we'll buy everything and then do another rotation in a moment. Okay, this is something you'll never need. Those uh, silk, satan stuff. Fame 8. Some healing items, I guess. Ah, oh, okay, not the healing items, more like alchemy stuff. Okay, he's here. Try to do it. Still no wine. Does no one sell wine? Is there any bonus to getting them to a hundred? No. No, obviously the bonus is benevolence, propriety, there you go. Righteousness even. Nothing of interest. So we'll just meditate a bit. Um, we want to buy some books, that's for certain. Fish, we don't need tools, we don't need. Maybe some additional... Do you have anything? Yes, perfect. Still no wine.
I'd buy some candy as well. Some uh, food, some candy. Take it. Food, candy. And study item. Yeah, that's like the important stuff. Mm, sure, we can enter for Linja. Magic Pen Master. No, the hidden fire army does not like me. Oh, there's a unicorn armor for sale. Good thing that all your armor is ignored. Mm. Okay, we should actually try it and all, but... I don't want to bother. I sincerely do not want to bother with that. Just get gone with gambling a bit. Okay, so the game just crashed when traveling. I have no clue what's left in terms of saves. Okay, two minutes. Okay, easy. Doesn't matter. Wait, Linen. So it actually traveled to Linen City, but then crashed. Couldn't get less. Like a time loss of like a minute at most. So I'll just clear this out again. Perfect, he has like 550. Like we don't care about the money, we care about progress. He doesn't have even enough yet. Okay, book guy. Candy guy und sie. Wenn man mich bewegen lassen würde. Why do you move like that? And then we'll actually try to defeat the Vagabond. I think we're ready. I'll gladly participate. Now there's actually a perfect like way to get the price raised. For this item they will not like I it should be like not surpass 10k. As such if you do the 9190 bet you can actually save some money. There you go. I got the 9,190 bet. So this way I can save like 1k money. No special auction, sure. Insane progress. Bomb.
I'm really healthy now due to the celestial flower thingy. Like this is looking quite good. I lost a uh, heavily wounded trade as well. We could probably... Uh, okay, I want to keep resilient. It is 18% less damage take, but damage transfer resilient would be good combo. If we enter like all kinds of buildings in the cities, and we're most likely gonna join that army as well. I do not have the top achiever trait. This is something we actually need to do as well. All the scholar exams and everything. So I will try to rescue the emperor simply so I can get the top achiever. Uh, let's reset this. Well, we'll do this after I've eaten spaghetti. Yeah, yeah, I'm almost there. This is looking solid now. I'm still thinking about keeping intelligence low simply so I can get this plus one. Wisdom, I'd have to check how you can raise it again. I keep forgetting, I most often just spam that Confucius thingy. FAQ, I need help. Willie, you need to help me. Wisdom, answer riddles and couplets at the I figured out how to do <laughs> Ah, no. Courage, yeah, that's gonna be hard. Especially when these stupid, stupid generals steal my kills. Trustworthiness of city tasks, yeah. Okay, like, let's quick save now. And see if we can defeat the Vagabond. Like next episode, we'll do the different scholar things. Oh, easy, easy every time. I, 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 I get an action. I don't think I have like drags or the good. Yo, look at the insane damage. Insane. That's why I'm going pure constitution build, by the way. I, I, I'm just gonna defeat the enemies by stalling. Get some top quality martial arts. I'm thinking Infinity Sword, Nameless Sword, combine those two together. That's gonna be like heavy hits. Get the towers straight, like Way of Nature, definitely. I would like to, in the next episode, also. Yes, yes, we'll. Okay, first of all, try to not path near her. I don't want to bother. Come on, please let me through. Uh, yeah, I'd like to farm some back garden, back mountain stuff. Do the riddles. Get like most likely get some genuine knowledge by going through every single building there is. Help them out. Okay. Not looking good. They are just thrashing them. Yeah, not looking too good. I'm only level 29 as well. I'm thinking like more like 50. If I had the damage transfer node right there, game changer, absolute game changer. But yeah, that's my idea for the next episode. So we'll see us then. I'll only save my progress and then. Thanks for watching, see you next time.